The Chinese government is accusing two Canadians of spying. Kevin and Julia Garrett are suspected of stealing state secrets and collecting national security and military information. Their family believes they're being detained in Dandong, a city on the border with North Korea. Susan Lunn is following developments for us from Ottawa. Susan. Peter, for 30 years, Kevin and Julia Don Garrett have made China their home, recently running a small cafe. It's a place where locals practice their English over a cup of coffee and eat some Western food. The couple's son, Peter, spends a lot of time here. He lives in China, too. He met with Chinese authorities today and asked to see his parents. They said my parents are being held at an undisclosed location somewhere in Dandong and that they cannot reveal that location. Their other son, Simeon, lives in Vancouver now. He calls the accusations against his parents strange. After speaking with government officials in China and Canada, Simeon believes this has more to do with souring relations between the two countries. This is some type of a political play. Um, it's not necessarily directly related to my parents. It just happens to have them involved. So their specific actions, I believe, are a little bit less important than sort of the political level stuff. The Garrett's detainment comes one week after the Canadian government accused China of hacking into the computers at the National Research Council. So that juxtaposition is troubling and unusual and might one lead to wonder if it wasn't some sort of tit-for-tat retaliation. Foreign Affairs Minister John Baird was in China last week and he told media he had a frank discussion with his Chinese counterpart. That's sort of uh, losing face for, for the Chinese, so they probably felt that they had to retaliate. Michelle Juno Katsoya adds it's possible the Garretts were also an easy target because they are openly Christian in a country that is officially atheist. It could be sort of a double win-win situation for uh, the Chinese. Because they are Christian, they are a certain irritant. Because they are foreigners in an isolated area. Both sons are worried about their parents. Just uh, hope, they, hope they get out safely and uh, hopefully I can talk to them soon. The federal government says consular officials are providing assistance to the Garretts and that they are in touch with local authorities to monitor any developments closely. And Peter, tonight the Chinese embassy in Ottawa issued its own statement saying various rights of the couple are being fully guaranteed, adding there is no need to over-interpret this case. Susan Lunn in Ottawa tonight. Thanks, Susan.